So welcome to my article forge review where I'm actually going to go on the inside of this and create an article right in front of your eyes just to kind of show you an example of what this software tool can do, how it works, how quickly it works, and of course the quality and all the other great stuff that come along with this. Now before we continue, I do want to let you know that article forge does come with a free trial. I believe it's for five days if you're watching this on YouTube. If you look below this video, I'll put a link to that where you can get started and actually follow along with me just so you know exactly how things are going to go. So before we begin, I do want to let you know that I created a article. <clears throat> I pretty much named it Article Forge Review. What I'm going to do is talk about this mostly, but I also want to show you the process for what it's going to be like when it comes to using this tool. So uh, with that being said, what I'm going to do is go to the home page here. All you would need to do is go to new article. And as you can see right here, there's going to be two big main sections when it comes to creating your content. So first and foremost, you have the create a new article section. If you scroll down a little bit more, there's going to be the customize your article style section. So first and foremost, in the top section here, as you can see, there's going to be the ability to add your main keyword. Okay, then you can add sub keywords, as it says right here, one per line, no comma, parentheses, brackets, or too many single characters. So for example, you're going to have your main keyword on top. And the reason you want to add sub keywords is that it gives your article more things to talk about. It breaks it down more. So it's a little bit more specific. Okay. Also, aside from that, you do have the ability to utilize a few different languages. I just use English. I haven't found a need for using anything else. So what I want to do here is just come up with a random keyword. I love golf. So let's do something golf related. Okay, so after some uh, creative thinking, I came up with how to fix your golf swing and then a sub keyword, something else they can talk about is hit the golf ball farther. Okay, so that's gonna be the first section. If I scroll down a little bit more, it comes to the aspect where you can customize your article style. So for article length, you have very short 50 words, you have short, which is 250 words, you have medium, which is 500 words, and of course you have long, which is going to be 750. Just for this example, I'm gonna do medium, so I can you know actually read the article, talk about it, uh, and so on and so forth. They have the add titles option. You can add an image, you can add a video. All this is pretty self-explanatory. If you wanna replace keywords with links, there's the option for that where you would add the new replacement. Um, me, I personally don't use that. Uh, post to your WordPress blog. This is a feature right here where if you go to WordPress and post scheduler, you can schedule your articles to be posted there if you want. For me personally, I like going through and tweaking them a little, which I'll talk about later. And of course, they have the ability to add spinning powered by Word AI. Uh, this is going to be good if you're doing like mass pages or maybe local lead gen or something like that where you're going to have a similar article. And then you're going to maybe spin it and use it for different cities and locations, or maybe just affiliate marketing, whatever it's going to be. I personally use a different spinner that I had lifetime access to. So I think Word AI is done by the same company that does Article Forge. So I haven't personally used this, but if you own that software, you can just kind of turn it on and then connect it with your uh, API and email. Either way, um, like I said, it's very easy just to get the ball rolling that probably if I wasn't explaining this and you knew your keywords, this would take like 10 seconds. It's pretty much just choosing the amount of words uh, you toggle these on or off and add your keywords. Let's click on create new article. Now it's going to take about, let's say, I want to say a minute or so to create and uh, I'll let this go for a little just so you can see as this goes across. They also give you tips when you are creating your article. So I'll talk about this. This shouldn't take very long at all, but it says if you want Article Forge to write about your business, you can enter the industry your company is in as your main keyword in your business or product as a sub keyword. That way it will write an article about your industry, industry, <laughs> industry. There we go. And specifically mention your business. Okay. So uh, that's just a little tip. As you can see, it's not going to take too long. I wanted to go through the process and show you that. Uh, I will talk about the quality of that, but let me go to the article that I have done previously when I wrote my review. That'll also, if you're watching this in YouTube, that will be in the uh, description. So simply enough, I did one based upon Article Forge. Okay, we can also edit and delete stuff. But you can say if you want to like the article, you can give it a thumbs up, thumbs down, just so they know. These are just ways of kind of creating stuff if you want to go like this and this and this. Okay, anyway, so let me read a little bit of this just to kind of give you an idea of the quality. Let me look at this. Okay, that's still going. It probably takes about, I don't know, a minute, minute and a half, maybe two minutes, either way. So 
Article Forge is a very interesting concept that makes use of advanced algorithms while generating article content. It presents itself as a unique website content generator tool that actually writes entire articles for you out of scratch. You just have to enter a single keyword and in seconds you get fresh new articles. It makes use of a fancy alg algorithms, okay, that should be fancy algorithm to detect maybe or maybe I'm wrong, to detect keywords and then splits new content right in front of spits new content right in front of you. Um, let's just do this so that gets out of the way. Sure. Uh, without the hassle of manually writing each and every article. What's great about the Article Forge, that's about Article Forge, remember I just happened to add in thus, so that was correct, is that it completely eliminates the concept of article marketing. Now, this is actually a solid paragraph. I've talked about this in my review that I actually wrote, uh, is that this is a lot better than me like going on to iWriter and hiring someone. I get some of the worst articles ever. This is at least readable, it's related. It is, I'd say it's not the highest quality in the world. Like, So let me put this out there first. This is going to be a great tool for utilizing the ability to get quickly generated decent content. It's never going to like replace someone from writing high quality content. So for example, if you wanted to do like a review and you're trying to like, you know, uh, get to the top of Google and outright everyone like it's not going to be for that type of thing. However, it is going to be great, as I said before, for quickly generating these articles. And there's a lot of great uses for them, which I'll talk about as well. Let's move on to the next paragraph. This innovative tool was created by three very smart guys, Jason Cooper, Ryan Dicer, <laughs> and Brian Winters, who wanted to find a way to make internet marketing more effective and affordable for the average person. So this is one of the hiccups that I found when it comes to Article Forge. It's not great when it comes to names. I remember putting something in with ClickFunnels and it said it was made by, I don't know, someone else that wasn't Russell Brunson. Uh, maybe it's not in their algorithm, whatever it is, but either way, you could always just delete that aspect or when you copy this all, just remove this, okay? Obviously, Ryan Dice is the digital marketer guy. No, Brian Winters is an internet marketing. Jason Cooper, I'm not sure who that is. Maybe it was one of the creators, but it's not great when it comes to names. But aside that, let's keep continuing on. We can start right here. Uh, they did this by designing and implementing an algorithm-driven content spinning system. Well, that is correct, but it just wasn't them, okay? So spinning is a technique that allows authors to create dynamic and compelling titles out of scratch documents. This technique is applied on articles generated from spools and article bases. I'm not sure what spools is, but maybe that needs to be changed. Anyway, authors can use this tool to spin articles that are of high quality and have relevant contents without spending a lot of money. So... This could be content. So aside from that, like get rid of that aspect. Not all that bad. Like you had to remove an S there, but it flows at least much nicer, like I said, than a lot of articles that I've seen previously. And it's not too bad. It's directly related because remember, this does come with the ability to spin articles. I think the bottom part, uh, let me add this in there just to, so I get that out of the way. The bottom part is more about spinning. It does not matter if your primary keyword is SEO, digital marketing, or even make money online. Spinning a quality article will create a highly readable article with relevant keywords that will not only grab the attention of your readers, but also increase your Google page rank. So now it's starting to talk about benefits. The high quality articles created by this unique website content generator will appear on the first page of Google when a searcher types in a relevant keyword query. Well, that's the ultimate game plan, right? <laughs> Depending on what you're ranking for, because I'll tell you what, you're not going to rank for like the, the best of the best. You need a lot more than that. It's not just about, you know, article quality when it comes down to that. While it is helpful, you're going to need some links and authority, but that's just a different topic. The Google bot will recognize your article as well, and thus the keywords in your article will have the maximum chance to produce high quality links, assuming the fact that you rank high and someone's going to link to you. So all in all, this really isn't all that bad, okay? It's going to be very tough for the software to go in and like do what I do when, you know, I, I go into software, I demo it, I review it. It obviously can't do that. Like that would be insane because then we could literally replace humans for just like doing what humans do. Maybe they will in the future. Maybe we'll create machines like that. But all in all, it's pretty good if you ask me. There's a few things that you might need to tweak. That's why I recommended uh, that when you go in, I don't like, you know, directly posting it to websites. I like copying it, pasting it, and then making a few tweaks, maybe adding in a little bit more. And it's much easier that way, in my opinion. So with that being said, that was one of the articles that was created. You saw me go through and see what it's like when it comes to creating a new article. So let's see the result. So this is brand spanking new. I did this right in front of you. Uh, let's see, this was how to fix your golf swing. 
You may have wondered on how to fix your golf swing when you are having some problems with it. When your swing is not as good as you want it to be, then there must be a reason behind it. There are many reasons why this happens, but you should be able to find the root uh, cause of this problem so that you can deal with it soon. The best way to tackle this issue is to analyze what could have caused the problem. If you know what you could have been the reason, then you can work on the things that can help fix your swing. Okay, so there was a little redundancy in this. You could probably take out one or two of those sentences if you want. It's more about like, if you have a problem, you have to figure out why, and then look at the root of the problem, okay? Now we're getting into something a little better. Many golfers make the mistake of only looking at the symptoms of their golf swing. They try to look for the reason why they are having some problems, like getting too many wrong hooks or slices. You can't expect to improve your golf swing if you only look at the things that are affecting it, but concentrate on the positive aspects instead of the negative. There are many ways on how to fix your golf swing, but the most important thing that you need to remember is that it's not about fixing one part of it, but addressing all the problems that you can. Once you are able to do that, you will notice that it will start to work for you. It's like having a jigsaw puzzle solved. You will be able to see the whole picture and what you really should do there and implement it. Remember that it's not an easy task to do, especially if you're used to always doing things the hard way. So be prepared to adapt your golf swing to a more effective one. Okay, and then it goes on and on uh, much more that I'm not going to read through. All in all, this isn't too bad, okay? This isn't going to be the type of highest quality article in the world, but for the ability that you can go in there, quickly create this, it takes about two minutes to do, probably less, uh, make some tweaks to it. This is going to be some good, I guess you could say, filler content. It's not going to be the highest quality. This isn't going to be replacing the best writer in the world anytime soon, but there's a lot of great uses for it. Uh, aside from actually being able to quickly create content, you're not going to need any of those like, you know, writers that are just like horrible. If you ever go to iWriter, I've had so many bad experiences. Like this content is much better. There's many times where if you're writing an article and maybe you need to write a little bit more, this is going to be great for you. Or maybe you have a site where you just wanted to get some traction, this is going to be great for you. If you're doing mass page sites, this is going to be perfect for you, especially for the fact that you can spin it. Like I said, plus there's other uses. Maybe you want to sell articles, okay? Obviously, it's not going to be the greatest type in the world, but it can also be spun articles where there's a lot of people who want that stuff. They're not familiar with Article Forge or they don't know how it works or not. They don't even know about the software or any other softwares related to it. So it's really going to be up to you and what you want to do with it. But when it comes to it, I do believe that... Uh, Article Forge is correct when it comes to the ability to create their content. Like it says, get high quality content in under 60 seconds. Everyone's definition of high quality is certainly different. Uh, like I said, they're not going to be able to compete with some of the highest of the highest quality when it comes to doing specific reviews. But this is a, a software if I feel like you're really interested in it, definitely try it out. It comes with a free trial. And like I said, there's plenty of uses for it. Once again, I'll put a link down below. Five day free trial, completely up to you if you want to uh, use that or not. I do recommend it, but... Last but not least, if you are still on YouTube, I will put a link deeper into the description where I actually uh, link to the article that I did, the written article about this, so you can read more about it in case viewing isn't your thing, or maybe you just want to get a little bit more information. All in all, thank you for watching my Article Forge review. I hope this helps you out when it comes to the demo, the features, what it comes along with, and if it's going to be perfect for you and your article marketing needs. Thank you for watching again, and have a great day.